everyone, welcome to our channel, Thai Food for Tater. I'm Alicia, and today we have a very special guest. Me, Lorelai! This is Lorelai. So this is Laura's oldest child. Yep. She's visiting her aunt this week, and we are doing the Imperfect Foods unboxing video together. We both have a refreshing drink. Um, don't worry, hers is just soda. We're just being very fancy right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. So no one calls the cops. Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Okay, so we haven't opened the box yet. We're gonna open it now. It's so it's like a little Christmas every time we do this. Um, for those of you who've watched the other videos that I've made on this, you know how this works. Um, just as a quick refresher though, with the Imperfect Food box, you get you can sign up for like a small, medium, large, extra, extra large, and it's uh, based on weight, and so depending, it's like a weight range, so depending on what items they have available, you might get a little more, a little less, you might get bigger items or smaller items, depending on the weight. And so sometimes the box is very big, sometimes if I get a lot of like leafy vegetables, for example, and sometimes the box is a little more, uh, well, smaller, like this one. So this is a little more tight, but it feels, it feels pretty sturdy, so we're gonna see what we get. It feels heavy. It does, right, a little bit. we did with the food, the food unboxing. Okay, so we've got the wrapping. That's always good. Okay, uh, Lorelai, why don't you pull out that item? And see what we got. We got, we got some broccoli. broccoli. Do you like broccoli? Yes, I do. I do. I like it with um, like on a, on a stove. Like a uh, um, cook. Cook. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Me too. Soggy and stuff. Exactly soggy. Mm -hmm. Um, maybe we'll make it for dinner. Okay, I'll pull up the next one. Carrots. Uh, I think I get a lot of carrots from them. Like, I like carrots a lot. I like boiling. You don't. You don't like carrots. <laughs> I don't like them. They make me want to throw up. <laughs> it, it makes me gag. When I was younger, I did not like carrots. Yeah. Uh, I've liked them. I started liking them a lot more as I, I was an adult. So this is good. I always use these. Let's see. We've also got um, some apples. Looks like we've got two. And also some pears, so some fruit. Um, you know, they sent me apples, in, I think, in the last one, and I didn't get through all of them because there was a bunch. Um, but this actually sounds really good for a snack later. Mm -hmm. Like a nice crispy mm -hmm. apple, some pears. Okay, why don't you pull out um, um, something? We got a little tiny garlic. A couple, couple, couple garlic. garlics. Yeah, yeah, garlics are always good for, for cooking. Garlic is delicious with Very. garlic bread. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, okay. That was an apple. Okay. Why don't you pull out another item? I want to say this is a potato, right? Mm -hmm. Potato. Potato. Looks like we've got a few. Yeah. Why don't you pull, pull all those potatoes out? Looks like... One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. And these, I know there's a special name for these. I forget what they're called, but they're very, like, they look, buttery. They're yeah, very, they look, like, soft and delicious. These are, like, my favorite. I know there's a special name for them, like... Yeah, they look different what. than a normal mm -hmm. potato. They're so good. Uh, let's see, then we also have some, looks like some sweet potatoes, yams right here. Different sizes, interesting. Uh, I think I mentioned this in a previous video, and your mom uh, told me how to do this, or su suggested it to me. Mm -hmm. Sauteing these with kale, because I, I like wasn't a big fan of sweet potatoes, and she's like, no, saute with kale, because then the bitter and the sweet kind of work together, and you get the kale a little crispy mm -hmm. and fried. It's like delicious, so Ooh. delicious. Okay, why don't you go ahead and pull out something else? Um, what is this? <laughs> Green onions? Green onions. I use these in almost everything when I'm cooking sauteing. Uh, let's see, we've got two zucchini. Oh, this would be good to throw this on that salad. We made a big salad last night. We still have some left over, but we didn't have any like cucumbers or zucchini on it, so this mm -hmm. would be good to do that. Then we got limes, right? Limes, too. Limes will be good. Limes, limes are good for like making a cocktail mm -hmm. or when we do like tacos, squeezing they, some lime on it. Ooh, they are good with burrito, um, breakfast burritos. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good. Then we got some avocados. Avocados, avocado. They've been sending a lot of avocados lately. Yeah, this is probably like the third box I've gotten avocados. So these, are, these will go. We'll leave these. Avocados from Mexico, exactly. <laughs> And uh, also in the, in the package that I signed up for, I always get two to four, depending on the weight, and I get two to four non-produce vegan items. So let's see what those two things are. So what's the first thing? We got some Sonoma, Sonoma Gourmet Pizza Sauce. Ooh, 
Ooh, okay, pizza sauce. That could be fun. We could do something. Mm, interesting. Heirloom tomato marinara. That actually sounds really good. Mm -hmm. And also, if, if we didn't want to put it on a pizza, we could always throw it on pasta or something. Yeah. But it's, you know, I think they formulate the, the pizza sauce to be kind of different, obviously, but it's still good. And then we've got something in this freezer package. Oh, we still have two items in here. So that, that, that sauce must have been part of like the produce part. So we've still got two other items. So we've got this one, Jack and Annie's Meatballs. You know, I saw this brand in Target. I've been seeing it lately and I haven't tried it yet. Yeah. Um, so now I can try it and see if it's going to be good. I've always used like Gardein meatballs and I love those. So we'll see if this is good. And it's funny, we were just talking about spaghetti meatballs. Oh yeah, we were for That's lunch. Exactly. So now maybe we can do this, you know, tomorrow or Wednesday or something. Yeah. Delicious. And there's one more item. Oh, how cute. It's a little juice. Oh my God. That is so cute. It's um, apple cider vinegar, raspberry, cold pressed. Interesting. And it says it's a detox. So it's a juice, but it must, you know, be healthy for you and interesting. Okay, well that's it. Uh, any any other comments you'd like to make about the video or the food or anything? Um, this stuff is good, some of it. <laughs> oh yes, we are definitely gonna have some fun making food tonight. Yes. Okay. Uh, thank you for watching our video. Uh, once again, Thai food for Tater. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. See you. Bye. Bye.